Hello hey, and welcome everyone to a Minecraft video. Now I never do Minecraft videos much, and maybe this is why, because it lags like freaking crazy. So first off, I'm actually going to do some apologies. Sorry if it lags right now like this. This is actually way worse than I was hoping. That's why I have fog all the way on and all that stuff. And um, sorry if you can hear me typing or anything, just to get all of that out of the way. So. Um, if you don't know, I have done some- wow, that was some serious lag. I have done some time-lapse videos of me building the Yogscast character- What the hell are you doing, sheep? The Yogscast characters in giant form. And, well, I guess enough people asked me on how to do a tutorial of how to build them. Gigantic. But I really wanted to not just show you how to build the Yogscast, but instead I'm going to show you how to build, like, any Minecraft character in general. So... If you look in the t top right or top left or bottom right or bottom left or wherever the hell it is, I'm going to have a picture of the person I'm building and that's going to be someone created a Robocop and I just decided that'd be a cool one to do a tutorial for. So this, yes, I am teaching you how to build giant people in Minecraft. So first off, this is the most important part. You have to get a picture just like the one I have on the screen right now and planetminecraft.com has these pictures where it shows every single side of the skin. So that works out perfectly. So I really recommend that. Do that if you can, get those pictures and it shows every side and you'll be able to do it easily. So once you have that picture, I normally print it out and then this is the key part. Every single pixel on that picture, considering Minecraft is a pixelated games, a game, pixelated game, every single pixel is really well shown. So just each pixel is one block. So if you look at the bottom of this guy, he has white at the very bottom. And if you didn't know, every single Minecraft character has eight blocks. Is that eight? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight blocks for their legs. So four for each leg. And it goes, I'm not used to this flying yet. Four that way, and then eight again, obviously, to match it to the other side. So once you get that done, like it's just very simple, very easy, you just copy this. Now I did some of this wrong back here, which I just noticed right now actually. And some of it doesn't matter because another tricky thing with building giant people is with the skins, you can have one side of a block one color and the other side a different color. So I can't actually do that in building it. So some of it is going to be different. Now I'm going to say this is the back here, so I'm going to make this block what block is it it has like these two in the center no it's these two in the center are gray or something but these are gray too but i can't make it gray because then the side would be gray oh but the side is gray so that's okay that's okay so i'm going to be using um stone for the gray instead of because there's not really a light gray wool that really fits this category so there we go that's that and some more stone there so that is the bottom. That's how I start every single creation I make. Now, I don't want to show you guys me building the entire thing because it takes me normally at least 20 minutes because I have to keep looking back at the picture. So I'm just going to give you some basic information. Each single person is like 12 blocks up to their hips and that's where you will start the arms. So just pretend it goes white all the way up. I know it doesn't, but 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8... 9, 10, 11, 12. So this is exactly where you would start the hips. Like, this is where the hip would be, and the arms would actually start right over here. So, actually, you know what? I really want to show you guys me doing it properly, but I don't think I have time. So, you know, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it the way. I'm just going to go through this really quickly, as quick as I can. I'm used to doing it with mods. I'm used to, it's just, I'm not used to this. It's way more different. So, yes, it goes 12 blocks high, and then you would start the arms. I never normally build like this if you've seen my time lapses, but I'm getting off topic like crazy. It's what I do. It's just, I can't help it. So, I would you start the arms actually up here. That's where the arm would start, and each arm is four, holy crap, four blocks that way. So, like, one, two, three, four. But, um, I'm pretty sure it's, yeah, it's four this way too, and then four that way. Not like that. There. And it would be like that, and it would go all the way down, and all the way up. So it would be like that. All the way to the top. 
Holy crap, I'm slow. <laughs> not used to 1.8 yet, but it is helpful for not having to tell you guys how to download mods and all this stuff. So that's basically what it would look like. I'm hoping you guys can see because I have fog on, but that is the bottom there. That's how tall he is. That's where the arms are. So I'm actually going to cut this next part and I will actually be like done half of it when I come back. So for you, it's going to be like one millisecond. For me, it's going to take way longer. I just need to explain the head and then basically you can get started yourself. Okay guys, so as you can see, I have made it all the way up to the top of the, the man, I guess he is. And as you can also notice, there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 blocks, like I said before, so it is perfect. I've got it exact, except for some of the sides where it's broken a bit. So if you just saw that thing on the screen, sorry, I had to turn the volume off or else you'll be able to hear some weird noises. So, yes, that is that. And now I'm going to show you the head, which is always insanely important. And because you can't actually notice this really if you're looking at a bad picture. Now, if you do look at the picture the, from the side point of view, the head is actually two blocks out. So the head starts right here. Actually, no, 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 I'm stupid. I'm giving you guys false information. The head starts right there and right there. So it is, again, another eight blocks, I think. Or is that nine blocks? That's eight, right? I don't feel like counting. One, two, three, four. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I don't know. Something like that. There's an amount of blocks. Just start it in the same spot where you had the legs. So yeah, it's eight. And it actually goes two out like that and two out like that. If you don't do that, it'll look insanely retarded because I did that with my first one, Honeydew, and it ended up looking like he had a really flat head. So it has to go two out. And with this guy... Actually, he does have black on the side of his head for some reason. It is Robocop, so whatever. But, other than that, you need sandstone for the bottom because it can't... Sand doesn't float. And always go two out, and you start with a flat layer like I'm doing here. And that's how you do that. And you just bring this across. You don't want to do that because you can actually see that. And you do it in the back as well. Two across here and two across there so that's how you will build someone's head that's the base of the head and it's very simple and the head i'm pretty sure is eight blocks high one two three four five six seven eight yeah okay it's eight blocks high so it's really easy to do a head i find it actually the most fun part because it's the part that like distinguishes the person once you see that you're getting that right, then it's like, you know, you're doing a good job, it looks cool and stuff, so that always seems to work out nicely. It's always my favorite part to do the head, especially if with Honeydew, that was a fun one to do his head because I it was, it was just fun. I don't know. So as you can see, I'm just doing this very simply, and sometimes I go right across the front because I like to finish it like that. Oh, see, that's what happens if you screw up with the sand. So, this was a very easy person. If you think it was difficult and you still don't understand how to do this, you can message me, you can read the description, you can comment asking, I will reply unless I get way too many comments. Then send me a private message, I will definitely read it. So, thanks everyone for watching. And, you know, I think I'm going to finish off this head with you guys here. So, I just want to say if you're watching this in the morning, have a great day. If you're watching this tonight, have a good sleep. And sorry the information was scattered all the way throughout the video. Remember, message me, read the description, all the information will be there. And I will see you guys later. Goodbye. Not actually, I'm still here, but sort of. Never mind, you know what I mean, right? Yeah, you're smart, hopefully.